I'm spreading some piles of hay just beneath the great oak tree for the horses because I'm getting them to graze off this field. They haven't been in this field for, gosh, a good few years in parts of it. They were up over there at one stage, uh, maybe last year, the year before, but all of this, the horses haven't been anywhere near. So I'm trying to spread the dung beetle population. But as I'm spreading the hay, <laughs> somebody is looking distinctly cold and chilly. Not you, Maya, you're full of energy and bump, but Inca is feeling the chill. <laughs> Anyway, I'm going to keep spreading the bale of hay for the horses and the dung beetles. So it's a combined effort. The horses are up over the ridge. Just you can see their backs right there. They're over there because I gave them um, a scoop of grain. So they're munching that so that I can spread this hay and move the fence in peace. Inca has found the warmest place is in the lee of the wind. So north is that way and it's a north wind blowing. So she's lovely and cozy in the sun with a pile of hay. Whoops. To protect her. And the horses want... No, no. Leave them be. I've just given the horses a new square and they want more. I am giving them more but I have to prevent them from galloping over the rest of the field and tearing it up because it's food. Now, a few of the pock marks are fine in the soil because that's good for insects that need bare ground, so, like the tawny mining bee. Anyway, here we go. This thistle is blooming. This is late November. You can see there's buds there and the beautiful purple blooms here. This is a different sort of thistle. We have a varieties of thistles here, but I can almost guarantee you that those two horses will graze that thistle. They will eat that thistle because those will taste like delicious sweets to them. And then the rest of the thistle has a lot of nutrients. There's, this is another species of thistle which isn't flowering at the moment, but you can see it has the broader leaves. We have about three different kinds of thistles here. The dogs have all joined me looking at thistles. They don't like sitting on thistles, but the horses enjoy eating the thistles. So tomorrow, that thistle is gonna be gone. So they have their uses, horses, eating thistles in the autumn.